It is stated that once Sayyidina Umar Farooq radiallahu ta'ala said, when I am inflicted with any calamity, even then, he says, I am blessed with four blessings of Allah Azza wa This is the mindset that we need to have. One, I don't indulge in sin at the time due to that calamity. So whilst I'm busy in solving that calamity or overcoming that problem, I'm not committing any other sin. At that time, I'm glad that a bigger calamity has not befallen me. At the time of calamity, I remain content over it. And at the time of calamity, I do dua that Ya Allah accept my patience and I do dua that Allah reward me for my patience. I've been blessed with an illness and hopefully this illness will be a means of forgiveness for me. And as a result of this, inshallah, if I remain patient, I will get the pleasure of Allah Azza wa Jalla. So we need to remain patient. Whatever problems we are facing, whatever difficulties you are facing, and yes, we understand that everybody's difficulties, everybody's problems are not the same. You may be sitting there and saying, yeah, well, it's all right for you to sit there and say this. You don't know the problems that I'm going through. No, I don't. What I am saying to you is, by, by losing your patience, by getting angry, by taking it out on your family, by doing something like this, what are you going to achieve? The problem is not going to go away, the problem is still going to be there. But at least by being patient, at least doing shukr that you're not in that situation that somebody is worse off than you, then insha'Allah Azza wa Jalla you will be rewarded for it. So take everything as a positive. The Prophet of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, Whomsoever Allah Azza wa Jalla intends goodness for, he, he Almighty inflicts them with a calamity. And you know, if you think about it, many of us, you know, have not faced the calamities that people around the world have faced. And I'm scared. Personally, I'm scared. That I think to myself that Allah Azza wa Jalla has given me so much. And if I was tested like those people are tested around the world, would, would I have the same patience? And I pray to Allah Azza wa Jalla that I would. 